Hello everyone. This is double elimination for seven teams or seven number of entries. In seven teams, we have 12 games. And scene seven is not included in the power of twos, meaning it has buy. And to determine the buy, we have buy equals power of two minus n. And the next higher power of two to seven is eight. So that eight minus seven equals one. Meaning we have one buy. And take note that we use the asterisk to identify the buy. And since we have one buy, if we have only one buy, it must be placed at the top of the upper bracket. Now, let's proceed to diagram and game schedule. Since we have one buy, meaning we have six competing teams in the first round. One, two, three, four, five, six. From the top, the vertical line, then the game number, game one, game two, game three, and then let us have the result. Winner 1, Winner 2, Winner 3. Then let the buy play in the second round. Vertical line from the top. Then the game number. This will be game 4. And this will be game. Five. Let us have the result. Winner four. Winner five. Now, let's let's proceed to losers bracket. This is the winners bracket, and then the other side is for losers bracket. Now, let's start with. Game 1 Loser 1 Game 2 Loser 2 Game 3 Loser 3 And then the game 4 Loser 4 Now, let them play. So, loser 4 will be playing against loser 2. And loser 1 will be playing against loser 3. So, that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and this will be game six and this will be game seven let us have the uh, result winner six winner seven now let's go back to winner's bracket winner four will be playing against winner 5 in game in game 8 let's have the result winner 8 now let's go back to losers bracket so we have two concern in uh, winners bracket the loser 5 and then the loser 8 
but this will be game 9. So let us have the result. Winner 9. So our first concern is loser 5. So loser 5 against winner 9. Or game 10. So let us have the result. Winner 10. So don't forget to draw the broken line for loser 5. From game 5. Now, we have one remaining concern, the loser 8. So that loser 8 must be placed here against winner 10 in game 11. So that winner 11 will be playing against winner 8 in game 12. So this will be the final game. Let us have the result. Now, our concern is if winner 11 wins in game 12, meaning winner 8 and winner 11 has the same number of blues. So that, don't forget to write your note that if winner 11 wins game 12, there shall be playoff. That is to break the tie because winner 8 is twice to beat. Now, let's proceed to game schedule. Since we have 12 games, Now, let's interpret the diagram. In game 1, we have 2 versus 3. 2 versus 3. In game 2, we have 4 versus 5. 4 versus 5. In game 3, we have 6 versus 7. 6 versus 7. In game 4, we have 1 versus winner 1. 1 versus winner 1. In game 5, we have winner 2 versus winner 3. Winner 2 versus winner 3. In game 6, we have loser 4 versus loser 2. Loser 4 versus loser 2. In game 7, we have loser 1 versus loser 3. Loser 1 versus Loser 3. In game 8, we have winner 4 versus winner 5. Winner 4 versus winner 5. In game 9, we have winner 6 versus winner 7. Winner 6 versus winner 7. In game 10, we have winner 9 versus loser 5. Winner 9 versus loser 5. In game 11, we have winner 10 versus loser 8. Winner 10 versus loser 8. And in game 12, we have winner 8 versus winner 11. Winner 8 versus winner 11. This is the diagram and game schedule for 7 teams in double elimination.